yellow on yellow, oil on Pantone, the viability of the visceral versus uh, received advertising ready technology. There's some good news here, which is that finally uh, you can have a cloud of your own. Uh, now that could be as far as uh, information storage, but I also think it has to do with a thought cloud or uh, kind of Mick Jagger get off of my cloud. This Benjamin Moore color chart represents uh, where that could fall as far as uh, value or chroma. Uh, with these nicely evocative titles, Breath of Fresh Air, Soft Sky, Sapphire Ice, Soft Jazz, Blue Dragon, Old Glory, or Blueberry Hill. Key food is always my favorite, and whether it's uh, tomatoes for 99 cents or Route 80, as rendered in uh, cadmium red, which is how the tomatoes get to our fair city. Uh, either one has the sense of uh, idealism that I'm looking for. This is our close friend, uh, Lucio Fontana, who liked to fold, pierce, spindle, and mutilate. Uh, I would like to bring to the surface some issues of uh, erotica and the body in relation to his work. And yet, somehow, I find it necessary to return to genre titling in this case. Still life with geraniums. I'm very sorry about what happened in the Ukraine. But at least we have fresh produce. This diagrammatic chart with aluminum paint and Benjamin Moore grays is a representation of the varieties of religious experience, a title that comes from none other than the philosopher uh, William James. Here, our friend Ad Reinhardt has lost his head temporarily in a cloud of his own or of my construction, principally composed of chrome yellow Lefranc bourgeois oil paint. I have entitled this head of a sailor, again in a kind of American Victorian tradition, and we're working with oil on canvas specifically as a medium. When one frames experience properly, it can then become the stuff of memory. Other times Obliteration is a better strategy, especially when amplifying the tactility of the subject matter. I like to mine art history, specifically 57th Street galleries, in this case Sidney Janis, with the New Realists show, which helped to introduce the pop ethos even before Leo Castelli. This depiction of the autobiography of Alice B. Toklas by Gertrude Stein, of course, is accompanied by an illustration of a self-destructing sculpture by Eve Tangeli. Eve Klein's anthropometries, as realized through brush contact, the cruelty of aluminum when paired with birthday party palette, more produce, in this case star ruby grapefruits and their succulent internalized psychosexual nature. Nobody wanted to admit that they still like Louise Nevelson and it's tough when you grew up in the 60s and 70s and that's all there was for art but sometimes you have to thread it into your autobiography and learn about yourself all over again. News headline, Christie's to return Cambodian statue. Good news. News headline, data backs idea that Malaysian plane crashed into Indian Ocean. Mystery solved. 
more specious attacks on reform. Arrest is no help for ruined wedding plans. Sad story. You see one like this every day. Let's return to some traditional subject matter. Still life with fruit. Thanks to Frank Stella, 1959, cardboard and enamel paint on wood. Here's the Frank Stella show at Leo Caselli Gallery. New York, 1964. <laughs> I guess I'll leave you with these selected letters of Bernard Berenson, which were so difficult for me to work my way through that I've depicted my struggle in most uh, violent terms. Thank you. Thank you.